Hey, what's going on everybody? So we're back at the house again. Come to take a look at it in the daylight. Just to see what kind of shape it's in. Um, if you haven't been following along, we did talk to the property owner of this old place. And he did express his interest in selling it. So, sorry about the echo, by the way. So we've been here for a couple of hours now. Just kind of looking around and assessing the situation. Um, this place is going to need a lot of work. A lot of work. The bones of the place are still there, and structurally, it's still structurally, it's still sound. This is one of the better rooms of the place. You got some stuff that needs to be done to the ceiling in this room, and most of the rooms, the ceiling is going to need to be just dropped and and repaired. But anyway, so far we've noticed. Uh, from what we've seen today, it does need leveled. It's gonna be pretty dark, y'all ain't gonna be able to see too well. I did go back up in the attic and it looked like that it had been gutted um, as far as the electrical wire goes. Some, some crackhead went in there and stripped it out, most likely. Windows that need to be replaced. The cool thing about this house is the uh, the walls they're not they're not two by fours they're uh two by sixes so it's thicker i'll show you right here you'll be able to see a little better it's uh the uh, walls are much thicker than what you'd see in a mobile home or or something else like that the exterior walls are the same thickness as these so that would help out on heating and cooling um, We were just kind of trying to come get an idea of what we would be comfortable paying this guy for this house <laughs> and seeing what all it needed. It needs work done to the siding, um, but it is not the asbestos. Uh, uh, but it is not the asbestos shingling, so that's good. It's had a brand new roof put on it about ten years ago. Um, and it, it does need some work around the on the eaves but it's not terrible and it also has a huge yard just as far as you can see over there to that house that property line there and then uh it's got a one acre track back here as well stacy and um aaron and sarah are all down there now we'll see if we can go find them it's it's got a lot of potential. It needs a ton of work, but it's got a lot of potential. Um, and to be honest, we've lived in about the same conditions before. And what you just saw, minus the wiring and all that, that's kind of the that's kind of the condition our current home that we live in now is in when we first moved in. It's got these beautiful live oaks. There's a couple of those out here. I mean, it may just look like junk to a lot of you guys, but I'm seeing a lot of potential here. I really am. Uh, I hope we can come to an agreement with this guy. I mean, look at these, look at these live oaks. Amazing. They're so beautiful. It's got a little barn that's still in decent enough shape um and i've said um a lot here lately i'm trying to break myself of that i do apologize and everything that we're on here is part of the property hey buddy there's a little crater hole over there it's kind of cool it needs a lot a lot of work but it's certainly something we could build up for our family. There's a couple of little trash piles around here like that. It has not been taken care of or showed any kind of love. 
in a lot of years. But it is. Um, but it does have potential. And if we can get it from the guy cheap enough, you know, it would be worth it to us. Just walking through all these dadgum cactuses out here. to mow all that stuff down um, we're working our way towards my favorite part of this place well the land in itself is probably my favorite part but they're having so much fun already so some illegal dumping going on over here we'd have to get all that cleaned up actually this is our this would be our property line here so uh i mean probably clean that up just so we didn't have to look at it you see a bridge so we just walked through oh with a property line so at this point we are off of what would be considered our property. Whoa. I stuck this down in there. That's, that might be a cave. That's probably a varmint hole though. That's Come on, keep hole. going that way. Are you yep. Showing everybody this place. Keep your eyes peeled for snakes. So, we have crossed the property line and are now currently on city property. Arrowheads because Indians have been here because yes. there's shells everywhere. It's uh it's actually pretty nice, uh-huh. And now getting closer to what I consider one of the best things about this place. Coming up on it. You guys see it? Oh my gosh. Look at that, guys. Look at that. I already feel like I'm at home. So hopefully this whole thing works out and we can have the river in our backyard. Can. Show us. Oh, dang it. <laughs> Hopefully it works out where we can have the river in our Ooh, backyard. Maybe and, I can skip this one. Uh, let's see. Enough enough room for our Oh it did it! <laughs> you call that skipping a rock? Yeah, it skips. Let me show you how the master does it, boy. Oh, really Watch this. That was yeah. actually pretty pathetic. I you want to jump in? Yeah, I want to get in the water. That water's probably 30 degrees. Actually, today, it was like, it got up to like 75 degrees, so it was actually a pretty nice day. Can I get out? Can I get in the water? No. You'll be swept away. Put, touch your hand in that water. Okay. Give me a hand. There you go. Yeah, you really want to jump in that? Yeah. No, you don't. Yeah, I do. I do want to jump in did you? Stacy's bone collecting. <laughs> oh, always. Oh yeah. This one's very strange. I don't know. What do you think about the place? Awesome. Yeah. Yeah, it's great. The land Ooh. is awesome. Yeah. Let me look at that. Bones. So this is actually considered city property at this the point. That fence that you crossed back it's there? Human bones for all I know. There's sure's a lot of snail shells out here and yeah. the Indians. Pretty cool. We're gonna start saving up more money so we can hopefully make a make an offer on this place. More shells, more shells there. Look, Indian there, campground. There's a spring in this area too. Yeah. For I sure. Know. Well like I said, there's so many shells. Yeah. Can I get in the water? water? No. Dang no, up. you're not getting in no water. So that's the plan. We're going to try to save up some money, make an offer on this place, and 
hopefully have a little left over to start fixing it up that is the play anyway just kind of wanted to give you guys a a tour of what could possibly be our new our new home pretty pretty cool right now it's kind of a turd but it's definitely got potential definitely got potential I know, I saw that. <laughs> Triangles. Here's a little pole barn that's on the property. I'll walk out and show it to you, actually. It's kind of in bad shape, but I guess it could be repaired if one wanted to do so. It's actually got a slab, half a slab foundation towards the back. You see that? Pretty cool. <laughs> this is how the animal looked. Oh my gosh. How does he eat? How does he eat? We're out in the woods on my phone. Hey, what's going on everybody? It is time for the dumpster diving portion of this video. Um, we showed you the house earlier. What did you guys think about that? You think it's worth it? You think it's a good idea? Think it'd be good for our family? What do y'all think? Yeah. Um, <laughs> We've got that out of the way, and we're going to see if we can find some cool stuff to either resell, donate, or recycle for scrap metal. So, or keep. Or, or keep, eat. Or keep for ourselves. Or, or eat. Yeah. Anything valuable, anything <laughs> useful, anything tasty. Or donate. <laughs> so, with that being said, let's get right into it Wait. and see what we find. Look at my bed. Here, get the camera to me. What? <laughs> Look at my bed that I made. He's sleeping. Look at Aaron's. Hey, stop there. Starting off with this one. This one has been good to us in the past. Okay. Not seeing much in here now, though. Uh, I got a phone charger. In the ground. Money in the ground. What's that? I don't know what that is. One of the, uh, is those, are those all blank? Mm -hmm. I think I just found a bunch of blank CDs. It doesn't look like they've been. Oh, yeah, those are new. Are they? Yeah. Charging oh, is this a uh, jewel oh, case? Cool. Yeah. I don't know what that is. That'd be a good eBay item, though, for sure. We'll take that too. One of the uh, viewers gave us an idea, and we've since adopted it. Uh, she said to to put things like books and other useful items that we don't really want for ourselves at the gas pumps and uh and people take them that's all wet so we've kind of been doing that i got nothing else so we got the the blank cds the cases for said cds and a book all right cool McDonald's Spider-Man. Oh, that's cool. That's not like Spider-Man though, is it? It says Spider-Man on it. See? <laughs> this is the dumpster we found all the food in. Actually, both times in a row. Stacy beat us over there to it. Let's see if she's got anything. No. Nope. Pretty empty. Oh well. Better luck. For you guys who've been watching the videos, has that door always been there? Because I swear I don't remember that door being there.
That thing's full. That's too full to look in, really. I swear I don't remember that door. It's gonna drive me nuts. I'm gonna have to pull up one of the old videos real quick and check. All right. Man, I can't even get into dumpster diving because all I can think about is that house and what it could possibly be for us. Pretty excited about it, to be honest with you. Very, very excited about it. We had Stacy's dad, there's a helicopter. We had Stacy's dad come over and take a look at the place and um, oh, yeah. see cat food. He's been doing that kind of work for a long time. You getting in? Get with it, gal. Ew. You're taking too long. Oh, I was. Oh, wow. <laughs> nice. For real, they already bagged it for us. Yeah. Okay, take that. Some dumpster kitty food. I think it says puppy on it. Oh, it's dog food. Uh -uh. Nice. There's a little hidden can in there in that bag. Yep, there's another one right down there too. Okay. We'll take those too. All right, so some puppy food. And no, Stacy, that is not a valid reason to get another dog. Oh, I don't want another dog. What for? What is that? I'm mean, This place doesn't really throw away pet beds or anything like that. Did we? Oh. Alright, I guess that's it. Not bad. Let's see the loot. Let's see the loot. Oh yeah, it's like half a bag full. Nothing wrong with that. So anyway, Stacy's dad checked the place out for us. And uh, he's been in, uh, not necessarily the construction business, not necessarily in the construction business, but uh, he's done lots of remodeling and uh, that kind of thing. So we had him come over and give us his expert opinion. And from what he says, it isn't too bad. Um, it's definitely going to need a lot of work and it's going to cost uh, quite a bit to do the work but you know he's pretty knowledgeable in that and we've got a lot of people that will help us out so it's definitely possible definitely possible we don't know if it'll turn into anything but we're pushing for it do 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 um really seen anything we haven't been out in several days but it seems like all the trash is still the same you guys remember those rolls of wire we pulled out of here we took those to the scrapyard and got like seven bucks for them I thought it was gonna be uh, like low-grade communications wire but they actually gave us number two for it That's nasty. This is the uh, auto parts dumpster that sometimes has good scrap. And that's sometimes, but not terribly often. Uh, 
sometimes good scrapping this little guy here. Maybe not this time though. Maybe not. Yeah. Right. This is our electrician's dumpster. We sometimes find good scrap wire in. That's, that box has got something in it. Looks like it's gonna be some Christmas stuff. Hopefully it's full of Christmas lights. No, nope, just boxes. And what is that? Okay. That looks like a good chunk of copper. There's some good wire. Some wire. I believe so. I do believe so. Yeah. It's actually a pretty decent looking tree, huh? Well, half of it anyway. Oh, it looks a little broke. What do you mean broke? Look at it. No, Look we're taking it. that. There ain't nothing wrong with that. We're going to take that tree. I was just kidding. I was just tricking you. All right. All right. One of our favorite stops. Let's see if we got anything cool in these in these things here. Looks like that's the Broke. All right, let's go see if Stacy found anything. You got anything? No. Nothing at all, huh? Mm -mm. No. <laughs> hey. Huh? What is that? Is that paint? Yeah, it's a paint Oh, look. They just painted these things. Oh, no. Did they really? Yeah, they're still wet. Don't touch them. I definitely did. Yeah. All right, let's go. Oh, boy. All right, I'll see some... I see some pallets in there. I don't know what that is. There's some broken, busted totes. Got a mattress over here. That's the leg to that table down there. I bet you that's a pretty nice table too. Oh. Huh? Oh, I see. <laughs> More dumpster diving. It's kind of been a slow night so far, but uh, that's the way it goes sometimes. That's just the way it is. Hey, what is that on top of the recycling dumpster? It's just the... Uh, okay. Oh, okay. okay. Those are huge boxes. Good night.
Somebody already sliced in that to see what it was. Uh, five below dumpster. Why not? The recycling one's completely empty. What a mess. I bet you that was uh I bet you that was somebody Whoa. back. Is there a lot of stuff? Look at that. Oh wow. That's nice. It is. That's a beautiful headboard. Watch out. Uh, I'll Ooh. go open the thing up. Okay. What's wrong with it, I wonder? Hey, is there anything in that box back there? I don't know, I can't tell. I like, I want to take this, but I don't know what we would do with it. Mm, yeah. It is pretty nice. It's really nice. It's like for a that's like for a full bed or something. I just don't know. Yeah. It takes up a lot of space and I just don't know what we would do with it or how long we would have to sit on it for, you know? Yeah. That sucks because it's really nice. Hopefully somebody else will get it though. Really? I had to dig underneath that. Alright, so Stacy just did a solo dive yeah, at I the Alta. And she pulled a bunch See, of like nasty said, out of here. They make it real gross so you won't mess oh with it. God. I know. Yeah, so you go and you just clean it up and see what you got. Do you think there's anything salvageable at all in there? I don't know. I've seen, like, I joined that Facebook group and I've seen them, like, I don't know, getting stuff from it. So, we'll see. All right. I'm kind of excited. First one. Try it out. Why not? Yeah. We'll check it out and see. It's different. It's a nasty mess. <laughs> Somebody told her that. Somebody told her that they just take and make all the stuff in there nasty, so you'll be less inclined to grab it. But that you could clean it up and actually salvage some out of there, which we've done that with food before. We pulled up and in, uh, in the dumpsters, and you know everything is slashed and destroyed. But then you start taking you know stuff out of packages, and you can actually save some of it that hasn't been destroyed. Maybe the same thing right yeah absolutely i think it might be we'll know at the end i will clean it up and we'll let everybody know if we got everything all right cool the metal's got makeup all over it well i was digging in the box trying to get the stuff and i didn't realize i was digging inside of a box oh my God. she said there was a bunch of metal in this makeup alta dumpster so i'm gonna check and see <laughs> yeah see look Where? these pieces here these Oh, those lights. Is that what that is? I don't know. Yeah, that's some decent scrap. There's some stuff in there. Too bad you got makeup all over the place. Oh, hey, there's more stuff in there. Cool. No. <laughs> what a freaking mess, dude. What? I know, I have it all over my sleeve. See, there's some more pieces. There's a bunch there's of it. Tester on it. Oh, it looks like there's some more boxes down there. Too. Yeah, this is definitely worth a pick. And this should go for short iron, too. Nice. I'll go ahead and start loading some of this up in the truck. Scrap life. Hey, give me my nipple can of bargain. No. Please. Oh, 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 oh. What do you want my knee for? Yeah, that's good scrap. And in Waco, I think the short iron goes for like nine cents a pound. Yeah, really heavy. Thank you. That should be a decent little payout. 
Okay. Watch out. Yeah, that ought to be a decent little payout. Is there any more metal? Hey, that's nice. It is. Is there any more metal? Um, I don't see. Yeah, so I can dig for more metal. <laughs> Hell yeah, cowboy! All right, I think that's all the metal. Hey, come here. What? I can't borrow you. <laughs> oh, woman. That I am. Mm. What are you doing? Alright, she says she's got two more boxes of this destroyed stuff. There's one right, can you grab this one right here for me? I ain't got no gloves on, it looks messy. Oh, okay, I'll grab it. Stacy, somebody on Facebook told her there's salvageable stuff in there. I guess it's possible. I don't know. There's a bunch of more boxes too, but we'll start with this. See if it's not, it's not. If it's not, I still got a bunch of scrap metal. Scrap life! That's a bunch of short iron too, so. And that's a bunch of makeup. Knuckies. <laughs> you don't know uh. it's going to be any good. No, I'm betting you there's nothing in that bag that's in those boxes. I mean, maybe. You might like, I, I doubt there's anything full. You know? You'll like be able to get scraps, probably. <laughs> like you might be able to salvage a little bit that's left in a bottle or something. Hey, okay, it's gonna be fun. Yeah? Well, guys, <laughs> fun hey, for you, I ain't helping. Hey, I what, buddy? I know this girl that loves makeup. For real? Yes. In your class? Yeah. Is she cute? Are you trying to get her or be her girlfriend or something or what? No. Well, I'm her girlfriend. What? <laughs> yeah, he said something really ridiculous. To the girl? No, I'm serious. What did you say to her? He said that whenever he grows up, he would marry her. You told her that, buddy? That's true. <laughs> <laughs> what did she say? What? She said nothing she, about it. She agreed. She's down with it? Yep. yep. Alright, well maybe you can take her some makeup. Win her over that way. I'll take her back since she loves it. Okay. Well, she's still gonna marry me. That's serious. I'm serious. That's a true. Really? Yep. Alright. Alright, I got an Aldi's dumpster. Let's see if there's anything coat. Whoa. Oh, cool. Looks uh, like we got some dry goods here. There's some snack ball. Oh, cool. Cereal. Oh. Here. Buttermilk cake. Ooh, look, I got some too. Yes. Okay, take that. That's a little tiny box. I know, well. Is there enough to go along with all this? What is all that? Oh, more buttermilk. Hey, what are we looking at here? What is this? I don't know. Sounds like something that's supposed to be kept cold and it's hot. Hold on, I'm going to get an yeah. here. Ooh, avocados? Oh, no, those are any good. Those are from Mexico. <laughs> no, they're from Peru. They feel okay. Do you want a couple? 
If they don't, okay, sure, why not? Uh, I'll be back. Yeah, go load that up. Uh, so much cereal. Uh, that one's got some yuck on it, so. Dead gummit, you guys didn't remind me to wear gloves. We'll do that. What else do we got in here? Uh, here you go. Take that. There's some spray. Wow, Don't go anywhere. Good. There's another. Here. Right, go ahead and take it. Um, okay, just be careful over here because I got a bump. Okay. Ugh. Oh, that's gross. Something just grabbed my leg. Oh my god. I don't know what that was, dude. Did fall on you? Probably, but it felt like a raccoon's hand. <laughs> Alright, you see anything else? I'll take a couple of these bananas too. Oh yeah, get them. So actually, these bananas all look pretty good. All right. Here. I can't get that. Well, get what you got and then come back. I swear, something grabbed my leg, man. That freaked me out so bad. Here's our box. Some sweet potatoes. That's a pretty good little haul. Oh. Right, let's get out of here. Okay. Alright. This is the CVS that destroys everything. Oh. Oh. What do you got? Oh. You got something? Nuh uh. Like canned goods? Yep. Really? There's a whole case right here. I don't know what they are. Okay, I'm coming. It's what? Pedia sure. Pedia sure? Yep. Sure, like uh, baby food? Not necessarily. Oh crap, so heavy, sorry. Ah. Oh wow. Dang. Get that. Is there anything else in here? I don't know. I watch just out. don't know what the date is on this. I'll just watch worry out. About it take later. it. Take it. Okay. That box is full of something too. Let me put you guys on my head and we'll go ahead and jump in here. That other box is full of stuff too. Oh, I know, I see that. I don't know if it's destroyed or not. It looks like it is. Yeah. box is full of something. Mm -hmm. It's a UPS thing. Oh, Whoa. Nice. 
donate life. I know, it's super heavy. Uh oh, check that out. Okay, this is a whole grab bag right here. There's deodorant, all kinds of stuff. Take the whole bag. Okay. Okay, this is another one, Stace. Is it destroyed? Uh-uh. Cool. Support the bottom. Just grab the whole thing. Okay. Yeah, some of it is wet. Huh? <clears throat> There's another can. Oh, no. There's another case. I knew I was stepping on something. <laughs> oh my gosh. Dude, all that stuff can be donated. That's crazy. Huh? I don't know. I guess, I don't know. Did you check this one over here? What? That Under here? Yeah. It's just uh, stocking trash. Okay. Alright guys, here is the outro part of the video. Tonight we found quite a bit of stuff. What is this anyway? Orange Jeff Jeffa pinks. <laughs> okay. We found a bunch of pancake mix. We found 11 of these, so that's a pretty good find. We found a 12 pack of Sprite, a full 12 pack of Sprite. Whoops. Yeah. And we found another one that had been busted open. We found a couple of cases. What is this stuff called, Stace? It's Pediasure. Pediasure. We found a couple of cases of those. I'm not even sure how I much. So. Those are about two months out of date, so those will definitely be donated. A um, bunch of snack bars. Usual. We found uh, a bunch of deodorant, actually. That was a really nice score in the CVS. Deodorant, some bubble gum, a bunch of bubble gum. We found some blank CDs. This is the mess that Stacy brought home. She picked, I think, three boxes. Four. Four, Four of this boxes. Ulta stuff here. Somebody on Facebook told her, a couple of people on Facebook told her that um, they kind of just smear this stuff on the outside, that if you went through it, that you would actually find some stuff. Um, so that's all trash. Um, she did get some makeup cases out of there that are kind of nice. And these are all Ulta brands, she said. So that's not terrible, I guess. I don't think she'll ever do that again, though. <laughs> what do you think, honey? No, I got lots of respect for you ladies that go out there and dumpster dive in that Ulta because it is a disaster. <laughs> I thought, what am I thinking? What out of all of that mess, this is what she ended up with. I don't even know what it is because, you know, I don't know what the makeup deal is about. But she got two things brand new in the package. that thing, that thing, that thing, that thing, That's and that thing. Cool. And then uh, she did get this pretty nice little makeup case, though, that for some reason or another they didn't destroy. Okay, there's the rest of the pancake mix couple of boxes of cereal there in the back we got some raisin bran frosted flakes rice krispies those guys rice krispies a couple of other bags of cereal there that the boxes were in bad shape on some bananas some sweet potatoes and onions and we also found all of these cans of dog food 
There's a ton of them. Still brand new. Probably just out of date. So, not a bad little dumpster dive, everybody. Thank yeah. you all for watching, especially if you made it to the end of this video. Appreciate all the love and the supportive comments that you guys give us on a daily basis. I appreciate everything you guys do for our family, and we will be back with another video tomorrow. Bye, Bye guys. Bye. 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 Bye.